guys you welcome back to our youtube channel we are super excited are you excited baby yeah very excited yeah i mean maybe you're not supporting me in my next plan <laughs> what's up what's up what's up guys eh? no, if you can't get the compliment no, take please. it grab it by the one what does that say you look good my love you look really amazing but black looks Sexy, sitting in the right place. <laughs> <laughs> so, guys, welcome back to our YouTube channel. Yes, you're welcome back but, to another <laughs> exciting episode. Yeah, of forever together with the Ekimas. That Please, is Ekima is my name. Ekima Emmanuel. Please subscribe, like, comment, share. I mean, we're we enjoying the feedback you guys are giving us. I mean, yeah. it's so amazing. Yeah. I mean, you guys are. Are blessing us you're the real deal you're the real deal if you're watching this video you're the real guy yeah. you're the real person make sure to hit that like button yeah. if you like our videos turn on the subscribe button and please share this video christ in the center, in the center. welcome to forever this is our perfect synchrony like leather and feathers No matter the weather we can storm the umbrellas Take a stroll in my heart Let's take this further when I'm beside you baby See my stakes get better Let me bet it all Destiny vendettas Rosy the emotional description of this love I am yours, you are mine The only thing that matters now We are the Ekimus Today we are discussing yeah. Wrong read You probably have noticed from yeah. the title so the, what we're discussing today is the wrong reasons people get, marry yeah. or get married. The pressure is real. <laughs> I know, I know, I know, I know. I don't know if it's the same for the men, <laughs> but yo, oh, yeah. for the women, hmm. for it's, the, real. it's <laughs> real. <laughs> pressure cuts across. Really? Yeah. Do you guys have pressure too? Oh. Does the pressure really cut across? I, I oh, feel yeah. like men don't really have pressure. Oh, too. baby, you are. <laughs> We act strong, but man, the pressures are there. Like are what? Pressure. How? <laughs> <laughs> what kind of pressures do you guys have? Please uh, uh, enlighten us. I will in the video. Don't worry, but I mean, there's a lot of pressure. There's a really? lot of pressure, yeah. Mm. Okay. Yeah. So, number one reason, wrong reason that people marry. Yes. Many of us have probably gone through this. <laughs> we, we are just from the festive season, and yo, we were in the villages, and I mean, some people in the villages, others only. But family, the parents are asking, mm. where is she? Where is he? Like, What's up? I am sure all of us have had that question asked to mm. us at some point, and that can like many people marry solely for that, yeah. Mm. Or you even say, you know, my mom or dad or who is a, is growing, is mm. aging, they can't, you know, they need grandkids. Yeah. Or even they demand, they say, you know what? What's up? Where are the kids? Yeah, we need kids. Where is we the need woman? a wedding. We need mm. a woman. We need a man. Mm. And that is not reason enough to yeah. marry. If I, that is the pressure you're getting, guys... Yeah. At the end of the day, they're not going to be. Unfortunately, yeah. however much you love your parents, we all love our parents. No offense, but they're not going to be with you in that marriage when yeah. you just marry someone just because they want you to marry. Yeah. I, I mean, what happens is that, uh, as you've rightly put it, mm. man, the pressures. Mother is saying, man, what's <laughs> up? And you know, what is the problem? Yeah. Are you failing to sport? Are you failing? So, I mean, that pressure. I mean, everybody, I think, has faced that pressure. Mm. Some have, some have not, but majority, mm. really. So you find that you're not making that commitment because maybe you're making a commitment to make to your, them, to make to your, them happy. To make mm. them happy. Mm. Yet at the end of it all, it's going to be the two of you. You and your wife are going to be forever and ever till death do you apart. And so, they won't be there to help Yeah, you. they will not be there. Yeah. So guys, uh, those are wrong reasons to marry because your parents are putting you on pressure, please. Go slowly. The mm. pressure is good, but tread slowly a bit. Yeah. yeah. Mm. The other point is marrying because you want to obtain a strong financial muscle. Yeah. So oh. you, ha you feel like, oh, of course, it's true two are better than one. Yeah. Mm. So you say, if I married, I think these projects that I'm struggling with, yeah. I would run faster than I'm running. Mm. Yeah, and it's true, two are better than one. If yeah. you know, if we are constructing a house, what someone would accomplish, one person in a 
period of time, two people can do double. Mm. So marrying solely for the reason of getting that financial support, mm. or maybe you know your family is struggling, you have siblings to look after, you have this, and you say, you know, let me find this man, maybe he can carry this burden with me. Or let me find this woman, maybe mm. she can carry this burden with me. Do you have something to add on to that? I mean, uh, it's, it's, it's trading in dangerous waters, I would say. Mm. Because uh, you, you, you have to look at a scenario when, what happens when the money dries up? Yeah. And the person can no longer afford to give you the money, can no longer afford to give you solve those problems that you are worried about. Mm. That maybe say rent, maybe say what, whatever mm. really is your issue. So what happens? Does mm. the love stop? Mm. Do you go in for a divorce? So those are totally di di different, a very bad reason to get married. I mean, mm. you, you can't rely on finances alone. Mm. Just, just like love alone is not enough. Yeah. You get. So finances yeah, as the sole reason why you're getting married mm. is really bad. I mean, you need to first figure out yourself and know that, okay, I can do this, I can solve it on my own. Mm. So that's a really wrong reason to marry. In itself. Yeah, in yeah? itself, yeah. yeah. So these reasons are if you're doing them independently. Yeah, yeah? independently, yeah. So another reason is uh, why it's the issue of age. Mm. Age, age, age. Mm -hmm. And I'll speak to age uh, in regards to the men. You come. I mean, for us guys, uh, once a guy clocks 35 to heading into the 40s, mm. the pressures come in. You're asking me about the pressures. The pressures now come in. Mm. Somebody's like, I, I need to just get off. Then you just start. To, you want anything that comes. Anyone that, ca anyone that ca comes around, you want to go with that person because That's now. That's your clock. The yeah, clock has yeah. reached and and the pressure has now come in. I mean, you're looking at your friends and you're like, wow, these ones are now moving. And you're worried that maybe say, you, may, you may not make it. So that is where the pressure comes in. Mm. The moment you realize you're aging, and it, it makes even matters worse for those that are abroad. Somebody's just like, you know what? Just get me anybody out there who's ready. Yeah, and I go with that person. So, okay. mm. yeah. So for, mm. for the men, the age of 35, 45. <laughs> a 50 man, you are, you are 50 or so. It's now the pressure is too much, actually. Yeah. yeah. Mm. It's almost like resigning. Yeah, because now everybody will look at you and be like, wow, eh, you're too old. Why? I think mm. people start in, inferring things or assuming things about you that maybe is this, maybe is this. Yeah. yeah. And the other point, which again ties into what you just said, my love, is. Mm. On the issue of my friends, mm. everyone is doing it. So yeah. lately, we've seen weddings are happening. Yeah, mm. weddings are happening in the lockdown. Everyone is wedding. This mm. COVID, like COVID came with weddings. Yeah, yeah. And the pressure is on. Like people are just like, yo, I'm like, delaying. Even this one, even this, one, even. Mm. Uh, even people who are younger than you are getting married, and it's mm. just like you're the only one in the world. Mm. No. Guys, it's just that weddings are publicized. Mm. And no one is going to come on the microphone and say, guys, today is not my wedding. No, that is not publicized. So there are many other people who are not wedding. Yeah. But it just happens that weddings are the ones that are celebrated. So you mm. get to know them. Yeah. Yeah. So the fact that your age mates are getting married should not be something mm. in itself to tell you, you know, let me go and also get married. Yeah. I was reminded by the aspect of, uh, of waiting. I mean... Everybody has his own time. So mm. guys, I mean, your friends may be getting married. You may think, I mean, God's timing is always the best. I think I'll go back to that. God's timing is the best. And I mean, we all have our own race to run. Yeah. Yes, your friends may be getting married and you know, you're worried. I mean, take all that worry to God. I mean, put mm. it in prayer. I mean, God's timing is the best. Never know is preparing something bigger. Yeah. Yeah. So... That's why we're saying a wrong reason to marry is because everyone is getting married and you are like, ah, since all my friends my have gotten married, mm. my age means, ah, chija chija, <laughs> as people say, whatever is around, let me pick <laughs> on that and, and go. So, yeah. yeah. So that's a wrong reason really to marry. The other wrong reason, my love? Yeah. So another wrong reason why people get married is that uh, people get married to, to for somebody to complete them. You. That one? Yeah. <laughs> that one I know there are many people whose tables are being shaken people have drinks on their table and we are shaking that table 
And it's not fair, but we must say it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so going, <laughs> thinking that a marriage will complete you. Yeah. That one, we could sing it all day, but no. We've said it in our previous videos, we always sing it. No one can complete you. Saying yeah. that, oh, I don't feel complete. Yeah. And, and we get it, by the way. I mm. have been there. I don't mm. know if you've been in that position where you feel like, eh, when I'm single, I don't feel complete. You need like a missing. relationship. Mm. Yeah, you need like a relationship. Eh? Mm. We've all been there, but it is the worst. Because then when you marry the person or when mm. you get into the relationship, you don't have your own life. You're fixated on this human being. Yeah. Mm. And you lose out on what you are supposed to be doing. Mm. So that is another terrible, terrible, terrible reason mm. for marrying. We won't go so much into it. We've discussed it in our previous videos. Yeah. But if that is what is on your mind as the major reason. No, please. Just pause. Those are all wrong reasons for getting yeah. married. Another wrong reason to get married is for status. I mean, you see, you want status. Okay, I'm married. Mm. I mean, <laughs> Bafumbo. Mm, Bafumbo, what? Marrieds. I mean, yeah, and that's the wives, sole reason. Us yeah. husbands, us mm. wives. The title must change mm. from. Mm? And there's also set, you know, when you're yeah. a wife, you're, eh? you're, you're up there. Yeah, yeah. yeah, husband, what? Yeah. I, I, I think, guys, that's also another wrong reason. Mm. Please don't do that. Don't get married because you want status. status. Mm. Marry for the right reasons. Get the right reasons. Let there be. There, it's a it's a buffet. I will call it it's a buffet of all things. But get the right reasons why you should marry. Not because you want status. I mean, mm. status can be status, but in the public, but in the bedroom, in the house, it's another. It's a nightmare. <laughs> in it's the bedroom. State. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you had to. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but guys, mm. that's for sure. And by the way, one thing I want to mention is that these points you probably already know. Yeah. Like you know. Mm. Mm? But we want to move from the place of knowing yeah. to actually acting it out. Yeah? Mm. Move from the place of I know that I am marrying for a wrong yeah. reason. But how do I deal with that loneliness in me? Yeah. Mm. How do I deal with the pressure of all my friends are married? married yeah. How do I deal with the pressure of my mom is on my case? Every time I meet her, she's yeah, like, she's... where is she? Mm. Where is he? Yeah. Eh? How do you deal with that? Yeah. For us, would say, go back to fixing your eyes on Christ. Yeah. Find your fulfillment in Christ. Yeah. Find your fulfillment in something higher than you. Yeah. And, and for us, that is Christ. Yeah? yeah. We've shared before that when a uh, person when I was, was dating, you know, I had that phase where I was like, you know what? I need to reevaluate my life, to find Christ, to mm. know who I am. And those three years I spent just not running after a relationship, not mm. trying to go into the next relationship, not mm. trying to, you know, to get the next big thing. Mm. I found my true identity. I cannot explain how amazing that is, yeah. guys. It is the most amazing thing mm. because then you're not under pressure. In fact, yeah. by the time I told you, by the time we got to get married, I mean, you are like, I want to get married like next year. And it's just like, mm -mm. Mm. I, I want, I have so many things I want to first accomplish. Mm. I was not under that, you know, the pressure, the yeah because for me it was higher than status yeah. i was not trying to appease anyone mm. I, w I had appreciated that i am running my race yeah. and it is my race yeah that race is not for my mom it's mm. not for my dad it is not for anyone yeah but mine so yeah to take off that pressure from yourself mm. find your true identity who are you mm. outside those relationships yeah. if we take away the, the boyfriend if we take away whatever who are you yeah. who are you without that title Mm. Even for this goes to the married people. Who are you when you're not a wife? Yeah. If we took away that Mrs. So and so title, who are you? Yeah, who are if we you? take away that Mr. So and so. Yeah, and I you? think men, mm. men you kinda know how to I don't know if I should call it selfishness, mm. but you know how to be who you like I don't know if you get what we I mean. We maintain who we you, are. Yeah, you I, I don't know if it's society that has allowed that, but you can you know men 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 know how to to know who they are and to remain, to, uh, to know their identity and keep in it even when they're married. Mm. For us, the women, it's like we struggle. Mm. Yeah. So that can help with yeah. dealing with that. Mm. Yeah. Another point, baby. Yeah, the other mm. wrong reason. Yeah, another wrong reason why you should not get married is because of your past relationships that have failed. So you feel like, wow, 
I need to also jump into people and make this right. And make I need, this right. People that I I can need to make people that sh let them know that this I is the right. Have, mm, yeah, I can. I mean, guys, deep down your heart, as I'm mentioning the point, you also know that it's wrong. Mm, I mean, that is not a reason why you should get married. So mm, try to avoid, try to run away from such reasons because you're trying to. I mean, you do not have to prove yourself to anyone. Yeah. I mean, it's your life. Mm. I mean, at the end of it all, it's your life. And we should know that marriage is a long-term journey. It's a, it's a commitment. It's a journey. I mean, till death do we apart. So, do not make it out of wanting to prove a point to somebody or to relatives or to friends or to mm. people that are laughing at you. I mean, you can do it in a better way. So, that's another wrong reason why people really should not get married. Okay. Yeah. Marrying to solve your problems. Mm. So, you're having issues in the relationship. You're conflicting Mm. And then you say, you know what? I think let's get married. Mm. We've dated, you know? Let's get yeah, married. Yeah, let's get married. It um, will solve it. Mm. I th you know, baby, you mentioned, and you know, people date for so long. I, what brings in, the comfort comes in, you know? Yeah. The comfort creeps in. I mean, if you ask, somebody will tell you, but the benefits of marriage, you're already having them. Why the wedding? Why mm. the wedding? I mean, they don't value it. They may not mm. look at it in, the, in that kind of way. So I think... But, I mean, we are saying again, dating for so long is not reason to marry. Mm. You may have dated for so long, but somebody is just, is your experience, is preparing you for the right person. Eh. <laughs> eh. That's, that's harsh. I know. Harsh. I know it's harsh, but I mean, sometimes. Sometimes, yeah, but also, I want us to be, you know, mm. To, I, I would want us to qualify that because mm. another person, because already the person who has wasted someone seven years mm. is probably looking for an excuse to, ju mm. to be justified to leave. Mm. And you know, we're not meant to be together. So let's, so such as what we are saying could, someone might interpret it that, oh, this is my leeway. Mm. I don't know, that's not what no, you're no, saying. No, no, no. Mm. For, as a matter of fact, stop wasting people's time. Yeah, yeah. Why should <laughs> you? If you know you're not going to marry them, yeah. why one year, two, three, four, mm. five, seven, ten, and then you're saying, we are probably not meant to mm, be. To be mm. Let me walk away. You get. So, I mean, it I hurts mean, somebody's emotions. Somebody, yeah, no, somebody it, has invested in a lot. Yeah, yeah, that time. I mean, time is something that can never come back. You've we all get the same time. Yeah. Mm. yeah. So don't just marry because it's the next thing on the agenda. If you yeah. feel like you don't want to do it, don't. Yeah. But to begin with, mm. don't prolonged dating yeah unnecessarily honestly i would call it unnecessarily because mm. it doesn't make sense it really does not if you know you have a reason kindly tell us in the comment <laughs> section yeah that justifies why you know i you mean people have different reasons yeah, yeah? i'm sure that people have their reasons but mm. in our opinion it's it's just not yeah so, yeah so guys yeah thank you so much <laughs> I mean, we have discussed the reasons. Uh, I hope it can touch someone. If you have not yet subscribed, please subscribe. Hit the like button. Comment. Yeah, I mean, share. share. We are here to grow. We are learning a lot from you. And keep the messages coming. Thank yeah. you so much. Love you. Till next time. Till next time. Bye-bye. Peace. Peace.